Zen Server is renowned for its ability to help developers maximize the production performance of their PHP applications. In this video, I'll give you a quick tour of eight different features that are available to help you do just that. First, Zen Server includes Zen Optimizer Plus, a bytecode cache for PHP, which innately improves the performance of your page load times. Second, starting with version 6.1, Zen Server supports Nginx, a web server well known for its highly performant and scalable characteristics. Third, inside Zen Server, you can easily, through the configuration interface, turn on and off features within Zen Server to help you minimize the Zen Server footprint itself. Fourth, you can also configure PHP easily right from inside the Zen Server interface. So if you turn off PHP features that you're not going to be using, you can reduce the footprint, the, the memory and the processor time that PHP pages require, thereby increasing performance and maximizing the number of requests that your given hardware can handle at a single instant in time. Fifth is the performance-related events that are built into the Zen Server eventing mechanism. You can see here we have a collection of slow request execution events that are easily visible in the overview dashboard or in the eventing system that allow me to drill down and look specifically at which requests are taking uh, an inordinate amount of time and even more specifically down into the code trace to see which specific line of code is causing that problem. Number six is page caching. If we look here at our application definitions and select the caching rules tab, we can go into a specific application and look at this defined caching rule. So this says the name of the rule is time. It's in this application and we're going to cache what we defined below for 180 seconds. Here we're saying we're going to cache the page in this application time.php. Now I can also add conditions if I want to. So uh, for example, I could uh, specify a specific caching rule on the uh, HTTP GET event for this page. In our case, we're just going to always cache it. Let's have a look at how that actually works. So here, in this application, we can navigate to the time.php page. Notice the default time is 712 milliseconds. If I refresh, that doesn't change. Let's go over here, run this timer for three minutes. We'll take a quick break. I'll be right back and we can see the page uh, after the three minutes has expired. We can look at the page, refresh that time. Now let's go ahead, head back over to that cached page. Remember that we set, this was set at 712 milliseconds. If we do a refresh, now you can see it's 738 milliseconds. So page caching is a great way to improve the performance of your PHP applications by caching pages whose dynamic content don't necessarily need to be updated for every request to that page. Seventh is a feature called data caching. Now, data caching isn't something that happens inside Zen Server's interface. It's actually API-specific code that you can write to cache bits of data inside your application. So instead of caching the entire page, you're going to cache certain pieces of data, and you can do that in two different ways. One is you can cache the disk. Notice this API called Zen Disk Cache Store, and then you could cache to memory Zen SHM cache store. Notice that you specify the key, specify the value, and this way inside your code itself you can cache bits of data rather than have to cache an entire page. And the eighth feature is Zen server job queuing. Now understand that job queuing is only available in the commercial versions of Zen server, but job queuing 
allows us to take bits of code and say, rather than have them be run when someone makes a specific request, we're automatically going to run those on some schedule, once an hour, once a day, once a week, once a month. So uh, we can do this for things like, um, say we're, we have an e-commerce store, the, the, catalog, uh, the catalog may need to be re-indexed periodically. Well, we don't, we don't want someone to necessarily have to do that um, when they think of it or predicate it on some collection of user events. We can specify that we're going to run, uh, run that bit of code you know, in off-peak hours once a week uh, so that it doesn't impact the performance of our production web service. So that's it. That's quickly eight features that are available in Zen Server to help you maximize the performance of your production PHP applications.